Hi everybody, it's Heather at Little Bird Blythe. Today I'm going to do a dolly dress up. Um, my daughter has put together some outfits for this cute little icy doll. And um, actually we've got quite a few of these. We've got these art bins from Amazon. And um, some of my favourite dolls have been put into these. And she has sorted through some of my clothing and sorted out some outfits for each of the dolls. So this is the icy doll, which um, we decided was going to be called Angela because that's on her tag. But it turns out that's probably what they all come with. So they're probably all called Angela. I do actually quite like the, the name Jessica for this doll. So I don't know, we might change it. But um, I really should put a little label on their boxes and then we'll know won't we what their names are um so let's get her dressed uh so you can see there's quite a few uh, little outfits here and we'll see what she looks like in them there we go Now this outfit is the one that she came in and it's absolutely adorable and I've been trying to find some fabric that is similar to this so that I can make some more um, and I've looked on Etsy to see if I can find out, um, it's find another outfit like this but I've not found anything at all um, and it's absolutely beautiful, it's got moths on it, I absolutely adore it, that sort of slightly off the shoulder look and longer um, arms on the dress I just think it's so cute and I love it I don't think it's not particularly well finished at the back but it's still it's still so beautiful I just love it the fabric's amazing so um, I don't know if any of you guys have seen anything that's similar on Etsy or well wherever let me know because I'd love to get some more clothes like this for her because I think it really suits her and these tights are just gorgeous I have seen some pretty tights on Etsy and I think I probably will be getting some so I'll show you when uh, when I do but um, she's so she's so pretty she's sort of really warming on me now I'm not really a fan of Icy but I think her face up is really good and although her fringes look a bit dodgy I do quite like her hairstyle. It's the fact that she's not got any eyelashes sort of bugs me slightly, so I probably will um, do something about that. I'm terrible, aren't I? I've just sort of left her in the box and I've not changed it. So she's got some really pretty eyes. Anyway, we're going to dress her, not just... Oh, I don't like pink at all. Not just chat about her. And I think we'll leave her on those for the moment and I'm going to change her into this cute little dress here. So we've got, I think we'll try this outfit first. Now my daughter's picked out some black tights, but I won't put black tights on my doll because um, of the staining issues. I'm not sure whether it, it's the same thing with Icy. The bodies seem very similar to Blythe, so I'm, I'm not going to put those on. Um, but she has picked out some other pretty tights. So we've got some lacy ones and some creamy white ones with some lace detail. They're cute. So let's try her in this. If I can open the dress up. I love press studs as a fastening for dolls' clothes. They're just so easy to use. She has a very slender figure, um, but it's very similar to a, a Lyca or a, a Blythe doll body. Gosh, will I get these tights off? This is the first time I've actually undressed her since getting her. Oops. Oh dear. Look what, what I've done there. Disaster. I'll have to fix those now. Gosh, they are tight tights. Okay. Again, sorry for the doll nudity. Let's pop her some tights on straight away. I keep meaning to make some tights for my dolls but um, they're a bit fiddly and it's getting the right fabric so I haven't done yet oh, 
They're so fiddly to get on, aren't they? I think when these are on, they're probably going to stay on. There may be some banging around shortly because the builders are back again today. Building a step out of the back. They're relatively quiet at the moment though, so they might have gone for a, a breakfast or something. I haven't made them a coffee yet, so they might be parched. I have to nip down and make them a cuppa. Oh, does anyone else find tights a bit laborious to put on? They look cute, obviously, but goodness gracious. It's like when you've got toddlers in there trying to put tights on a toddler. At least these don't run around. Right then, let's go with this little dress. My daughter's brilliant at picking out um, clothes for my dolls. She's really got an eye for the colours, which is great. I'm going to have to show you her um, designer doll collection. I say collection, we've actually thinned it out a bit because of... Um, space we've got so much stuff so many things in the playroom that uh, she's actually got rid of a couple but designer dolls they're 18 inch dolls and they're um they're very pretty and the clothes are really nice for them anyway i digress so that's a lovely little dress not sure about the necklace but that's very pretty maybe I was worried I'm going to snap those. And that gorgeous little purse on the chain there. That's cute. Very cute. And then let's see if we can get that on without breaking it. Ooh. No, that's not on properly, is it? Plasticky bit there. You can go on. There you go. Right now, she's picked out some little booties um, on the coat as well. Now, I don't know whether these are going to go. On. Oh, excuse me, that's one of my notifications. I have obviously sold something on Etsy. Oh, that's I'm struggling to get that on, to be honest. It's these um, inexpensive boots from eBay that we're all tempted into buying. Shoes and boots in bulk lots. Oh, now that one's gone on. This one needs to. Come on, get in there. They only fit certain dolls, don't they? The um, Basak Blythe, if that's how you say it, they do tend to fit on those because they have very slender legs. Right, that's gone in. Oh, they're cute. Not sure that fits particularly well. Maybe even got them on the wrong feet if that's a thing with dolls. Cute. Right, and we have also, if this goes with the brown boots, we've got a little coat. This is a, a stock outfit from French Trench, which I really like. I don't have the doll anymore. Um, but I quite like this outfit, so. That is cute, isn't it lovely? You know what, for my summer collection, spring summer collection, I'll be bringing out some little um, Max, I think, for the dolls, because I do like that. And I love Wellingtons on dolls. Honestly, they are so cute. Wellingtons on Blythe dolls. Oh, my word. Right, so that's lovely. And her little hat uh, which way that will go there we go oh there lovely set for autumn there aren't you sweetie pie pop your little purse back on she's going shopping or maybe she's going for a walk in the park meet some friends for coffee that's lovely these boots i'm not overly impressed with the boots so i might have to find some alternative footwear for her but that's a cute look though isn't it I like that well done good outfit cute french trench lovely outfit that is but the doll 
eyes it was one of those dolls where they actually went yellow which is a bit weird I don't know if anyone else has had that issue um, with a stock doll but the eyes were very much jaundiced um, so I got rid of that right then so on to the next outfit I love that that's cute so we'll keep that for her we'll keep the tights on just because I seriously cannot be bothered to take those tights off and I I'm a bit ham-fisted obviously and I don't want to risk breaking them I really like that little necklace I might have to have a go at making some little necklaces for dollies cute I don't know where that's from very nice this dress is sweet though isn't it isn't it finished lovely with those little buttons oh, scraping her face on the top that's not very nice is it okay there we go so next outfit let's try this one i think she does suit gray doesn't she oh she could wear the jacket with this one as well i think so i've just spotted the other item that my daughter has put with this outfit look a little dog so she could be taking the dog out for a walk and that cute so we've got little prestards those in. Oh sweet, lovely little outfit and she's got a bit of an oversized bag there. I think that one might be a bit too big for her but maybe this is her school bag. She could be carrying loads of things to school. And there she's with her little doggy, that's cute. So I like that outfit too, that's lovely. Now we don't have any shoes to go with that one. No. Got some more boots, but I think they probably won't fit like the other ones, so I'll have to have a look to see if I can find, Ooh, find some more shoes for her. So that's cute, I do like that outfit too. I think that one, I think she picked those to go together. Okay, so let's get her out of this one. That's such a lovely dress. I do like this one. Oh, pretty. I don't know who made that. Let's have a look. I'm sure I've shown this before, you know. Bell Mag Bell Magni dolls. I must look those up. See what else they do, because that is so cute. I like the colours. Okay, now I love this dress too. Oh, yellow. It's so sweet. My daughter's favourite colour is yellow my youngest daughter I've just bought myself a yellow handbag actually very nice there we go. oh that's cute isn't that lovely I love that collar little lacy collar that's so sweet I'm not sure who this one is by. I think it's probably a handmade one. It, well, I would say without a doubt it's a handmade. But where it came from, I don't know. Cute. Very cute. And she's got this. Now, will these fit? I don't know. Let's have a look. Oh, beautiful. Perfect. Cute little shoes. Oh, my word. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh, I love them. They're quite rubbery. They're so sweet. They're lovely. They are. I have so many things. My daughter's brilliant at picking stuff out. They, it started off life in just a massive box and we're trying to get a bit more organised. So I said to her, here, here's a massive box. Here are the dolls. I put them all in the separate compartments. Right, now find some nice outfits for them all. And she had a great time just sorting them out for me. And it meant um, that we'd be able to find things a lot quicker and find things that suit the dolls instead of just having a whole basket of stuff to search through and a little bag oh so that's she's set for a little party there isn't she that's so cute I like that so this she actually came with this little um headband on that's really sweet so she's got a little bag and her little shoes 
and I've just kept her in those same tights although she could have worn the lacy ones that's lovely and the little French trench um, jacket would go with all of these outfits she's very much um, we're looking at the autumnal colours aren't we at the moment my daughter was obviously in the right mood there but she's got sort of autumnal hair hasn't she beautiful okay so how many more outfits we've got two more outfits left so I'll just grab those take her out of this pretty yellow dress I like that style I like the um fact that it's sort of short but the, a little flared out skirt that's really nice I have used this quite a few times on dolls um, there's certain favorites you go back for aren't there okay so we'll go with this one next this one came on a doll one of the ones that I've changed the scalp on this is sort of a fireside look I think she's gone for oh that's lovely what I like about all these is they're all easy to do up because that's actually quite important for me because I'm a bit ham-fisted sometimes I drop things and um, struggle to do up little clasps and things I don't know why just the way I am oh look some little furry boots they're cute now they came with a dress I remember I've still got the dress and it's very very cute I will have to show you that it's uh, in a box over there the rest of the clothes that didn't get sorted out it's very cute but it needs mending oh that's lovely and that's why that's not included I would imagine Oh, that is lovely. What a fabulous look. Gorgeous. I'm going to make some more of these boots. They are so cute. I did not make these, but that's lovely. I love that look. Sort of sat by the fire. We could bring the little doll doggy in there, couldn't we? There we go. Oh, there she goes. She can sit with her little doggy and fuss her doggy while she's um, reading the paper. Cute. I like that. Another good look. And that really suits her, doesn't it? That little hat cute with a wispy hair sticking out the side very nice right then last outfit we'll keep her tights on again because it's another skirt and it looks like my daughter's gone for a stock hat here so this one's from mod molly um, which is really cute and she also has red hair well this one's not it's sort of red it's ready brown isn't it um, Mod Molly is very bright red and that really suits her. She's got some gorgeous clothes. I like the Mod Molly set. I've still got that doll. I love that doll. And this is nice uh, little skirt and this one's by Sugar Blocks on Etsy. Um, and I remember I actually bought this one off eBay. It was pre-owned um, and it was in a lot of items. Um, and it, it actually snapped so I had to re- um, we sew the waistband and some of the base material because it was coming off but it's a lovely dress I think I don't know these they're fish some koi carp maybe something like that I don't know I'm not brilliant with fish um, now she's got no top on here so my daughter's picked something with no top so she I don't think I'd let her out of the house like this I tell you I'll have to make her a little top for this outfit so that's cute because she's got um, a little cape which is nice and she can go out walking her doggy but she'd definitely need a top on under there she'd catch catch a cold I think she needs a little jumper I'll see if I can find a little jumper so we've got another pair of these cheap little boots and those ones went on a lot easier than the others so they actually look really cute and she's got her little beret again that really suits her doesn't it so the only thing missing there I think is a little jumper or something to go underneath and I have got a little cream jumper 
so I might have to find that out and pop her in that so that's lovely I like that and she's got a little teddy bear as well although I think the teddy bear maybe that fell out of that outfit because I think that would have looked good with that so she's got a little doggy she can walk a little doggy in the woods she's obviously a girl that likes the outdoors and likes to walk dogs so lovely outfits well done to my daughter for picking all of those they're super if you want to let me know which one is your favorite i may well dress her up in that and just keep her in that outfit for now i'll just leave her in this and then see if i can find a little uh, a little jumper um and what i might do is attempt to make a few more little booties um so she's got some more soft booties because they're so cute i'm trying to find her some welly bobs i think some wellingtons to wear Anyway, starting to ramble, um, probably been rambling all the way through, that's me I'm afraid. I hope you enjoyed this little dolly dress up. I did, it was lovely to have a bit of a break this morning and it's been incredibly quiet so I'm, I'm surprised about the builders. Maybe they um, just came and dropped off some materials today instead. So um, quite tranquil, I feel all chilled now, this is lovely, this has set me up for the day. Um, yeah i enjoy that i think probably should start my day more often with a dolly dress up shouldn't i i wonder whether you guys do as well so anyway let me know which is your favorite outfit uh, i hope you've enjoyed watching today if you have please do give me a thumbs up i do appreciate it very much it's nice to see the little thumbs up and if you haven't already then consider subscribing to my channel and clicking the notification bell if you'd like to know when i upload future videos um thank you for joining me i hope you guys are having a great day and enjoying some dolly fun i've been enjoying watching your videos um quite a few of you um upload fantastic videos and i, I love it and while i'm working um I often have to put them in my watch list so that I can see them later but um, if I get a chance when I'm working I sort of I listen to them in the background and then and watch them as well and I just really enjoy it and this has been such a wonderful um, hobby um, for me although I've not been doing it long I'm just I just thoroughly enjoy it and I thoroughly enjoy doing these videos as well so thank you so much for joining me and have a fantastic day and I look forward to seeing you in the next video take care everybody bye bye